Phil Hilborn here again from my studio in the UK and today I'm bringing you a demo of this the Empress German drive pedal for Prohita Roo. Now this pedal is not a full-on metal overdrive pedal or anything like that what it does is supposed to emulate the sound of 50s tube amps um, tweed type tube amps it's supposed to emulate the natural type breakup of those amps so it's quite subtle um, it's got four controls treble uh, gain, bass and output. So you've only got two EQs, but the two EQs you've got are quite versatile. They're more versatile than uh, you'd think. And although it's supposed to just do the, um, the tweed amp thing, um, which it does very well, it also does a lot of other stuff too, um, which I'll show you in a moment. So let's get on and have a look. So there's a the pedal. See you in a minute. Okay, now you can uh, see the pedal in the corner of the screen. Um, I'm just going to turn it off so you can hear that last sound with the pedal off. So here it is, it's a fairly insipid, neutral, clean sound. Okay, and it gets a lot more interesting turning that on. Um, if you play softly, it will sound very much the same. There won't be that much difference. If I play, if I go from and then go, it's kind of the same. But if you hit them hard, if I hit with the pedal off, hit it hard, and now I hit it hard with this, quite a lot different. There's a lot more, a uh, whole different EQ. It sounds a lot smoother. Um, you can also try. Uh, the breakup on single notes um, with this sort of amount of gain you'll get this kind of try and do that with it off and it will sound very kind of ordinary Not bad, it's just got not that much interest. Let's have a look at the EQ. Um, on the clean sound, um, you can try it with, uh, let's wick the bass up, leaving everything else as it is. Um, it will warm things up considerably. Turn the guitar down a bit, it'll clean up. Top end up now. Just go about the same the same way. It's very, turn it on. Okay, uh, let's try a bit more gain now. So I'm going to turn the gain up about three quarters. Turn the output down a bit now. Uh, put the bass and treble flat again. Um, you know, it's kind of like... Travel off. Travel up. Get the gain so it just breaks. You can hear it. There. Good 
great for chordal arpeggios. You get to play anything where you, you play softly. <laughs> Play hard, you want stuff to come out. Really good for bringing that sort of stuff out. Do it here. But the guitar still sounds like it's supposed to. It still sounds like a strat in this case. Um, okay, let's see what gain's on offer. So the gain's now flat out. Um, <laughs> So a fair bit again, um, to show you uh, a bit more uh, what it could do, let's get a more powerful guitar. So I just swapped guitars, be back in a minute. Okay, I've now swapped over to this SG. Um, without the pedal, it sounds like this. Uh, let's back front pick up, let's try the back pick up. Okay, put the pedal on. Front pick up. And for chords, I mean, it goes from a, a very clean to is very sensitive on this if you take it down just not to travel off yeah. you can hear the control there as I'm moving the um, moving the knob so you got Now let's change over to a dirtier, uh, even dirty guitar with a sound that I'm not sure this is supposed to do, but I actually quite like it when you use an amp that's a little bit dirty in the first place and use this to give you a little bit more and to change the EQ. So here we go, let's change the guitars again. Okay, here I am with the Richie Blackmore Strat. This time it's a lot more powerful than the other Strat, which is just a very standard one. This has got uh, see what I can pick up some. Um, so it's more of a rock machine. Um, if I have a sound, say, this dirty... And then you put the pedal on... A little bit of added fat EQ. Um, I really like that. Um, you can go from uh, touch sensitivity-wise um, let's bear in mind this is a single course, it's going to make a bit of a noise, um, but you can go... And that's sort of quite fat um, sort of sound to a full on... Um, rock thing quite easily. and. Uh, you, you can really hear the pickups, the changes as well. If you go from uh, Good sound that, and the EQ works great on that as well. You can take the bottom end off, 
put in a lot of top. And you, for picking, you get a lot of articulation, which is really nice. clean. So yeah, what's great with that? Let's try it with another guitar. Okay, here's a guitar that I'm more uh, familiar with, or more used to anyway, PRS. Um, Let's hear it with that. Here it is without anything, just a guitar. And front pick up. Okay, pedal on. Off. On. much difference in terms of gain there because everything's pretty much straight up but um, if I turn the gain you hear it there get a bit of noise it comes into its own again there's a whole new level of gain um, sustains ridiculous <laughs> It does a lot this pedal the EQ section alone is well worth checking out um, and it's not just for getting a tweed uh, emulation great for that but um, does more so give it a try and uh, good luck see you in the next one